Dan. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hi. You want to talk about some PPE? Absolutely. Hi, I'm Firefighter Crystal, and today we're going to talk about PPE, or as we like to call it, personal protective equipment. Hi, I'm Firefighter Stan, and PPE is something that all firefighters wear to keep themselves safe whenever they're on calls. Did you know that firefighters don't only run fire calls? A lot of our call base is actually made up of emergency medical calls. So in order for us to be able to take care of people for both scenarios, we are actually trained emergency medical technicians as well, which means we have two different types of PPE. So normally whenever you see firefighters, they're wearing their normal fire gear, as in their pants, their coats, and their helmets. But whenever we're operating as emergency medical technicians or ENTs, we have a completely separate set of PPE that we have to wear. So as you'll see what Firefighter Kyle is wearing is he has our protective gloves, our protective respirators, and our goggles. And these are what keep us safe on EMT calls. Crystal, we're on scene. We have an emergency call. You're right, Stan. What type of PPE should we wear? Well, we have a sick patient. So I think the emergency medical technician PPE is what we should wear. I agree. We should get our gloves, mask, and goggles. Do you have all of your PPE? I don't know. Maybe we should check. Let's check. Gloves? Gloves. Glasses? Glasses. Mask. Oh, I don't have my mask. We should put them on. I do have it in this hand. I just haven't put it on yet. Let's put them on. Okay. The correct way is over your mouth and nose with both straps behind your head. Good to go. Now that we've shown you the medical PPE part of our job, we'd love to show you the fire PPE part of our job. I'm gonna have Firefighter Stan help me show you how we put on our gear and what everything is. The first item that a firefighter is going to put on is his flash hood. It's gonna go over his head and it's gonna protect his neck. His boots will actually be inside of his pants so that he can slip off his duty boots put his feet into his fire boots and grab his pants and pull them up and go ahead and slip the suspenders over his shoulders. Next, they're gonna grab their jacket. They're gonna slip their jacket on, zip it up tight, make sure the Velcro stays in place and then put the Velcro strap around the neck. Next, the firefighter is going to grab his cylinder and turn it on. Once the cylinder is turned on, you will hear a little beep. The SCBA slips on just like a backpack. Once they put their SCBA mask on, they're gonna tighten down the straps to make sure that they can get a proper seal. Once they have a proper seal, they'll pull the flash hood back over the netting to make sure that their entire head and neck is covered. Once they have the mask and the flash hood on correctly, they're going to put their helmet on and make sure it's buckled and it fits tightly on their head. Next, the firefighter is going to grab their gloves and put them on. Once they have their gloves on, they're going to grab their regulator and click it into their SCBA mask to make sure that the SCBA is working properly. Those are things we use at TVK Fire Department and every fire department around the nation to keep ourselves safe from fire, EMS calls every day. If without those things, our job would be a lot harder. We're going to be posting a lot more videos throughout the next couple of weeks. We want to try and get people educated on the fire service in general, some safety tips for your house, and also just some of the equipment that we use and what our day-to-day -day lives are like. We'd really love for you guys to let your kids watch these videos and help them get excited about the fire service. We're going to be posting them on the Tiga K Fire Department Facebook page. 
Um, and if you guys would like to share it and let some people in your community know about it, that would be amazing. Uh, we're really open to getting the word out there and hopefully uh, we'll be able to see you guys soon and we hope you enjoy these videos. So you guys have a good day. Stay safe out there. Have a good one, guys. Thank you.